Welcome to back YouTube channel Master Auto Information please like and subscribe thy hit bell icon to follow the channel thanks for watching the videos. The F A18 Hornet has long been one of the most versatile and reliable multi-role fighter aircraft in the world. As of 2025, this combat proven aircraft continues to serve in multiple air forces and navies globally particularly in the United States Navy and Marine Corps. Designed originally in the late 1970s and introduced into service in the early 1980s, the F-A-18 has gone through decades of upgrades and refinements, keeping it relevant even in the modern era of stealth fighters and advanced electronic warfare systems. The 2025 version of the F-A-18 especially the F-A18E-F Super Hornet and the EA-18G Growler variant, showcases significant technological advancements in avionics, radar, weapons systems, and survivability. It proves that legacy platforms, when properly maintained and upgraded, can still play a vital role in today's military operations. Even with fifth-generation fighters like the F-35 taking the spotlight, the Hornet remains indispensable for fleet operations, air superiority, ground attack, electronic warfare, and carrier-based missions. One of the biggest strengths of the 2025 F-A18 is its multi-role capability. The aircraft can be configured quickly for a variety of mission types, whether it's flying a combat air patrol, conducting precision strikes on ground targets providing close air support to ground troops, or engaging in maritime interdiction, the F-A18 is ready for the task. This flexibility is why the aircraft has stayed relevant over the decades and continues to earn upgrades. The 2025 Super Hornet features a number of notable enhancements compared to its earlier versions. One of the major improvements lies in its radar system. The active electronically scanned array, ACER, Radar now offers better range, faster target tracking, and the ability to simultaneously track and engage multiple targets. This technology gives pilots superior situational awareness and targeting capabilities, especially in highly contested airspace. Another major improvement in the 2025 Hornet is its electronic warfare suite. The EA-18G Growler variant, in particular, has been equipped with updated ALQ-218 and ALQ-99 systems that allow it to jam enemy radar, communications, and missile systems. It can even disrupt enemy networks, making it a crucial asset during joint operations. The Growler has become an essential component in the U.S. Navy's air wings, flying alongside strike packages to provide electronic cover. The engines powering the 2025 F-A18 Super Hornet are two General Electric F-414 GE 400 turbofans, each capable of producing 22,000 pounds of thrust. These engines give the aircraft a maximum speed of Mach 1.8 and a combat radius of approximately 390 nautical miles. In aerial combat, the thrust-to-weight ratio and the aircraft's high angle of attack maneuverability make it a lethal adversary. Despite the age of its airframe, the Super Hornet still offers dogfighting capabilities that are relevant against modern threats. The cockpit of the 2025 Hornet has been redesigned for better ergonomics and effectiveness. It features a large area touchscreen display that consolidates flight, navigation, targeting, and sensor information. This digital glass cockpit reduces pilot workload and enhances mission effectiveness. It supports helmet-mounted queuing systems, allowing pilots to lock onto targets just by looking at them, which improves reaction times and combat efficiency. Another noteworthy advancement in the 2025 Super Hornet is its improved survivability. The aircraft has been equipped with upgraded countermeasures including radar warning receivers, infrared missile warning systems, and tow decoys. These systems are designed to detect, evade, 
and defeat incoming threats such as surface-to-air missiles or enemy aircraft. Combined with stealth features such as radar absorbent coatings and reduced radar cross-section design elements, the Hornet can operate in dangerous environments with reduced risk. On the weapons front, the 2025 F-A-18 can carry a wide array of air-to-air -air and air-to-ground munitions for air combat. It can be equipped with AIM-9X Sidewinders and AIM-120DM rams, providing both short and long-range engagement capability. For ground attack, it supports precision-guided munitions such as JDAMs, laser-guided bombs, and AGM-88 harm missiles for anti-radiation strikes. It also has a 20mm M61A2 Vulcan cannon for close-in combat situations. The aircraft's ability to integrate with new network-centric warfare systems is also a big win in 2025. The Hornet now works seamlessly with Link 16 and Maddle Data Links, allowing real-time information sharing between friendly aircraft, ships, and ground stations. This connectivity is essential for joint force operations where rapid coordination and data sharing lead to mission success. One of the Hornet's defining features has always been its carrier-based capability. The aircraft is designed with strengthened landing gear, a tail hook for arrested landings, and folding wings for easier storage aboard aircraft carriers. In 2025, the Super Hornet continues to perform takeoffs and landings from Nimitz and Ford class carriers, supporting air operations across the globe. Its versatility and durability make it a backbone of naval aviation. The 2025 Hornet also introduces the Block 3 upgrade, which is the most significant leap in the aircraft's development history. Block 3 offers enhanced network connectivity, reduced radar signature increased range with conformal fuel tanks, and an airframe life extended from 6,000 to 10,000 flight hours. This means that the aircraft can serve longer, carry more fuel without taking up weapon space, and be more survivable in modern warfare environments. The Block 3 Super Hornet also features advanced computing systems known as the Distributed Targeting Process Network, DTPN and the Tactical Targeting Network Technology, TTNT. These systems allow faster and more secure data processing and sharing, making the Hornet a more lethal and connected platform in joint and coalition operations. In 2025, the U.S. Navy continues to rely heavily on the Super Hornet as the backbone of its air wings, while the F-35C is being gradually integrated into carrier air wings. The Super Hornet still flies the bulk of the missions. Its lower cost, proven reliability, and mature logistics chain make it a practical solution for sustained operations. Additionally, its larger payload and twin engines offer benefits in certain mission profiles over the F-35. Internationally, countries like Australia, Canada, Finland, and Q8 still operate or are upgrading their Hornet fleets. The aircraft's expert success is due to its dependability, performance, and ease of maintenance. Many of these countries are either upgrading to newer configurations or integrating the Hornet with newer systems to ensure interoperability with NATO and Allied forces. Training on the Hornet remains robust in 2025. Pilots undergo simulation-based training and live flight exercises to master carrier operations, air combat maneuvering, and multi-role missions. The U.S. Navy's Top Gun program and other elite training schools continue to use the Super Hornet for advanced tactical instruction. Its presence in training commands highlights its enduring value. Maintenance-wise. The F-A-18 is known for its reliability and ease of service. The Navy has invested in predictive maintenance technologies using sensors and AI algorithms that monitor engine and system health. These tools help identify issues before they become serious problems, reducing downtime and increasing mission readiness rates. Environmentally, the Hornet in 2025 is also seeing some improvements. Though military aircraft are generally fuel-intensive, 
Efforts are underway to reduce emissions through improved engine efficiency and the testing of sustainable aviation fuels. While these initiatives are still early in military application, they reflect the growing emphasis on reducing environmental impact. In terms of combat experience, the F-A-18 has been battle-proven in numerous conflicts from Operation Desert Storm to missions in Iraq, Syria, Afghanistan and recent operations in the Pacific and Eastern Europe. It has consistently performed with high success rates, delivering ordnance precisely and returning safely, which reinforces its reputation as a reliable warhorse. Looking toward the future, the F-A-18 is expected to serve well into the 2030s and possibly beyond particularly in upgraded forms like the Block 3, while sixth-generation fighters are in development, and drones are taking on more roles in reconnaissance and strike, the Hornet will continue to serve alongside these systems as a trusted, flexible platform. Its evolution and continued upgrades ensure that it remains relevant in high-tech battle spaces. The 2025 F-A-18 Hornet represents the perfect combination of legacy reliability and cutting-edge upgrades. It has adapted to changing threats, new technology, and modern mission requirements without losing its core strengths. Its place on the carrier deck is secure and its presence in Allied Air Forces remains strong. It's a fighter that has stood the test of time, and in 2025, it continues to fly high, fight hard, and deliver results where it matters most. From air superiority to precision ground attack, from electronic warfare to reconnaissance, the Hornet continues to dominate the skies. It's an icon of naval aviation and a symbol of what happens when great engineering meets ongoing innovation. Thank you for watching. If you enjoyed learning about the 2025 F-A18 Hornet, please like the video, subscribe to the channel, and hit the bell icon so you never miss an update from Master Auto Information. We'll be no back soon with more in-depth features on the world's most powerful aircraft and vehicles.